This is my evaluation presentation on how my magazine represents social groups and what institution I distribute in my magazine and why. First of all, how does my magazine represent social groups? Uh, I believe my magazine represents social class of E, as the magazine is a music magazine about rap, and the genre of rap has a stereotype of black males that wear baggy clothes uh, that are known to be violent, which is why the targeted audience is, is a social group E or D as they would be more likely to listen to rap rather than someone in the social group A and B who would listen to classical music. My magazine is also aimed at for people for around 16 to 25 years as they are more likely interested uh, in my magazine based on its genre and content. The images used within my magazine represent social groups by the way that the artists are within my product addressed. The artists are seen wearing t-shirts and jeans with trainers and hoodies. This represents my artists I mean, my audience says they are not higher class and do not wear formal clothing like suits and uh, ties. Uh, it represents my audience to be laid back, chill people who enjoy spending their spare money and time on magazines such as mine. And my uh, audience would be interested in creating music themselves, which is why in the content page I've used an image of someone else creating music as it represents my uh, audience. They are represented to be confident, yet struggle to know where they are or what they want to do for everyone in life. The typography and language used within my magazine is large bold font. Uh, this is because my magazine is informal and uses slang and modern English, so it's not too informal for people to read. Um, to represent social groups in my magazine, as it says, people reading will be someone who is lower class rather than someone who is higher class who may listen to classical. The typography represents my audience as people who listen to music as a way to escape from problems or life troubles, as them themselves are home in life, compared to the more formal magazine which is read by higher class people as a way to waste spare time. The colours that I've used throughout my magazine are red because it suggests that the artists make music about violence and stressful moments within their lives which represent the lower class as uh, that's what they might uh, feel or have themselves. Um, the colours uh, represent my audience by suggesting that they are dangerous and can be fearful. Uh, my audience take this attitude from the rap songs that they hear and start to aspire to be more like the artist, even if that means following their mistakes by committing crime, like a lot of rappers talk about in their songs. Uh, what kind of institution might distribute my magazine and why? I believe an institution like Time Inc UK would be best to distribute my magazine as they have sold over 350 million copies previously from magazines such as Enemy, Look, Uncut and others. This institution will be able to distribute my magazine to a wider audience as they already have a large audience to fund their other magazines. My magazine will be distributed throughout shops and will also be distributed through digital ways as the digital distribution is being larger in the uh, industry. Time Inc also produces similar productions as mine, as such as M&E, which is a music magazine which focuses on less popular music. Enemy have produced magazines about artists such as Kendrick Lamar and Jay-Z, which are similar artists used within my magazine. Enemy has a large fan base, and I think that Time Inc can also distribute my magazine to similar figures as Enemy. Time Inc have also produced other well-known magazines such as Look, which gets roughly 116,000 viewers of the product to our print and digital distribution. However, this might be negative as Enemy is a similar publication to mine.